Whether you're using a deep well or shallow well cylinder, you really need to have some kind of screen below the cylinder. Now, there may be things in the water floating around down in your well, but most likely as you lower it down the well, you might get something inside of the cylinder. So here's a couple of ideas for you. Now, a quick simple thing to do is just get a foot valve. Now this is a regular old foot valve you can buy off of Amazon. It's got brass and stainless, but really important, if you buy a foot valve, take off the check valve assembly inside of it. All you want is the screen. You do not want to have a check valve in here and a check valve here because you might get air trapped in the line and you'll never get that air out. So a screen on the bottom is really important. Now here's another idea a friend showed me. He bought a big old piece of plastic well point. So this is the stuff that you put down in the well if you have a sandy well and use an electric pump. It makes a great screen. Now this has got a bunch of really small slotted holes in it. 0 0.010 inch slots. So you want to use a long piece, otherwise you might take a chance of plugging it up. Inch and a quarter, just glue a fittering on that, boom, now you have a big old long screen. So remember, always put something on the bottom of your cylinder to protect it, but don't ever put a check valve below it. Thanks for watching our video on the introduction to how a windmill pumps water. Be sure and check us out at texaswindmills.com for a lot more information about windmills and more detailed videos on windmills and windmill pump cylinders.